have a look at this. That's a little one. Hey, hi there. Um, I'm out in Dubai at the moment, and I'm at the uh, Tetra World Congress. And um, this is a really interesting place, so I thought I'd just run you through some of the places and some of the things I'm doing. Um, first thing, I'm staying with a mate of mine, so it's nice always not to stay in a hotel that can be a little painful. Anyway, I'm just going to take you on a little tour around here because they've got a nice place that um, we're staying in as well, but you've really <laughs> got to see this because this is so cool. Out here, um, now as I step out the door, it's like the wall of heat. And then let's just um, have a little look around. Welcome to Dubai, and this is the marina here. In the beautiful evening sky. It's been a fantastic day. It's going to walk you around and show you a few sights. And, uh, and down there is probably where I'm going to go for dinner later on. It's a beautiful spot. And out there is, um, not that you can see it particularly, but that's the palm. A uh, little bit hazy tonight with the, uh, right through the little gap in the middle there, uh, is the uh, Atlantis Hotel uh, out in Dubai. There you go. So, why am I here and what we're doing? Um, I'm doing the Tetra World Congress trade show at the moment, uh, which is an interesting event. It's not the best of trade shows, and that's sort of what I want to talk about tonight about um, how to make the best of those situations and um, how you can uh, make the best of your lot so to speak. Uh, I've also got my iPhone hanging on a balcony. Uh, I'll show you what's beneath it in a minute, um, so you might think I'm taking a slightly overt risk of doing this. And, um, but hopefully, anyway, it should be fun. We'll see how we go. Um, I'll tell you what happened. I um, uh, formed a relationship with a company over in Dubai. And this is to sell the Geostrap, which is the carbon fiber product um, that I'm working with currently at the moment. I'll, I'll put a link on later so you can have a look at that if you're interested in it. And um, some time ago when I set the deal up with Tony, um, he said that the World um, Tetra Con Conference is on in Dubai in May and um, would I like to go? And I, I thought, yeah, well I would, but I can't afford it. That's a mosque just starting up, by the way. And um, so I passed it on to Craig in the US and he thought he'd come. And about two weeks ago, I got a phone call from Craig saying, um, uh, really sorry, John, but I, I, I can't make it. Um, his daughter was getting married, and uh, uh, he went mothering Sunday on the, uh, the Sunday before the show, and it was a big event for him and his family. So he said, look, you know, would you mind, can you go? And I said, well, I can't really afford it. But um, Craig very kindly said that he would pay for me to come here. Um, you're not going to turn it down. So, you know, very grateful to Craig for covering the cost. and. Uh, um, getting me out of here and the thing about it was with the trade show you know you never ever ever know um, certainly when you've never been to one before how they're going to go and what, what, what you're going to do um, and how successful you're going to be and the Tetra show is an interesting one because it's um, we've been focusing an awful lot on mobile telephone um, uh, technology and this is a little bit more to do with emergency services and police and government uh, communication systems so it's a little bit of an unknown quantity and um, and truth be, it, it, it's not been brilliant because there haven't been that many people coming around. We're lodging on a stand with somebody else, uh, uh, another company that I think we'll do some work with and some business with. And that's where I wanted to come around to because, you know, if, 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 you, stood, if you stood there and you accepted that as being your, your position and, and, and as good as it was going to get, uh, just standing on a, show, on a stand with nobody coming and talking to you, uh, then you, you, you're probably making a bit of a mistake. And come about 11, 12 o'clock, when I sort of realised things weren't going absolutely brilliantly uh, in terms of the footfall and people coming along, I decided to pick up my stuff and walk and uh, I had my little bit of carbon fibre and I had my um, iPad with my pictures on and my images and I'm booked in a delegate, I've got every single right to go and talk to anybody in that building, it's all bought and paid for. So I went around every single stand in, 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 in the auditorium 
and um, I spoke to everybody that I could see had any kind of relevance to the product that I had. And, you know, it, it really changed the day. It made a massive difference. And I've met now two or three contacts, and I'm having further meetings tomorrow morning of people in Italy, of people in France, of people in Germany that I'd never talked to before and I would never have met if I hadn't come to this show. So, all things said and done, you know, bad result? No, good result in the end. And a good result, not because you waited for something to happen, uh, not because you, um, again, quote Don Gota, procrastinated and hoped it was going to come to you, uh, but because you make the effort and, and, and you really push out and you get something done and you achieve it. And, and, and really, at the end of the day, I feel very good. I feel like it's, it's been a worthwhile day. Uh, I've really enjoyed the time and, 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 and the, the people I've met here since I've been here. And I know we're going to get some work and business out of it. And on top of that, I had a really good inquiry from the UK tonight as well. So things are going great. And, um, you know, it's networking at its best. It's meeting new people. It's uh, creating new relationships and meeting people I've never met before. So I'm having good fun. And anyway, let, let, yeah, let me get my ugly face out of the way and just cut the view again and uh, see what you think. Thanks for watching. I'll catch up with you soon. Bye-bye. OK, uh, a minute ago, I was talking about my iPhone being on the balcony. And uh, I'll come out here again so you can see the wonderful view once again. And uh, there's the balcony. That's where I was standing. And um, I'm going to hold this very carefully. That is what was underneath. So there you go.